The Story of Faust, The Legend of the Man Who Sold His Soul to the Devil. The Legend of Faust is a very popular story in European, German folklore, and is told by many people in their own versions. This is a dramatic work by the eminent German poet, playwright, novelist, scientist, statesman, and philosopher Johann Wolfgang Goethe. 1749-1832. The story goes that Faust is a scholar, a genius. Literature, a doctor and an alchemist. He was extremely thirsty for knowledge, so much so that he began researching magic to satisfy his curiosity about all things. His office is filled with research tools and books stacked to the ceiling. Faust studied through all the university and number 39's faculties, passed his doctorate and worked as a professor for ten consecutive years. Despite his illustrious reputation, upon review, he admitted that he was still in quat, as smart as before in quat, and that his knowledge was too limited compared to the many secrets yet to be found in the universe. School books did not help him understand the origin of all things and their internal relationships. Regarding science, he cannot grasp and explain the nature of things in particular and of the universe in general. As a human being, he did not enjoy the life he was given by God. From then on, he believed that human science was powerless in the face of a world full of mysteries. Faust wishes to have some mysterious power with which he can satisfy his desire to discover the end of knowledge. With the magic guidebook, he used magic to call and ask God for guidance. Song then harshly expressed contempt for him like an ordinary animal and frightened him. He was fed up with the scholastic way of studying at the university with its and quat gray theories and quat, wanting to leave it to find the in quat, golden tree of green life and quat. There was a time when he intended to commit suicide by drinking poison. But at that moment, the church bell rang, making him remember his happy childhood and give up his shameful intentions. He had a tutor and close friend named Vacni. Some books said it was Wagner, a dry student whose habit of reading chapters and quotes bored him. One day, when he went out to the countryside for a walk on Easter, he encountered the demon Mephisto, or Mephistopheles the demon of hell, in the guise of a black dog. It realized what Faust wanted, it followed him home and promised to help him satisfy all his desires, but if he lost, he had to give his soul to the devil to suffer eternal slavery in hell. A challenge immediately took place between demons and humans. Faust proposed for himself a plan to constantly strive to enrich his knowledge of society and nature, and quat, wanting to find the ultimate sublime, wanting to explore ultimate secret and quat, wanting to and quat. Contain in my heart all the compassion, joy, good, and evil of the world and quat. But if the devil can prevent him from doing that, make him satisfied with himself, captivate him with base pleasures, then he loses. From then on, the devil tried every way to seduce Faust, bringing him to drinking parties among students. Faust dozen and hash thirty nine he like it and wants to hide away. Devils want to stay. But the group of students realized that Mephisto was a demon and took out knives to attack both of them. Thanks to Faust and number 39's magic, the two escaped, while the students were stunned. Who said there are no miracles in this life? Going to the witches and number 39. Kitchen. People want Faust to drink a magic elixir. At first, Faust did not accept. But Mephisto cleverly pleaded, he drank and saw the most beautiful image of a woman in a broken mirror. 
The magic medicine makes him see that every woman is beautiful. The desire for love has awakened. Mephisto used magic to rejuvenate Faust and arranged for Faust to meet Gretzen, helping Faust impress her, a beautiful and pure girl, with the intention of letting him be happy with love and give up his plan to continue. Journey of Scientific Discovery The passionate love between two people controlled by demons causes them to encounter many hardships and injustices. When Gretzen became pregnant with Faust, Gretzen and Hash 39's brother knew about it and challenged Faust to a duel. With Mephisto and number 39's assistants, Faust kills Gretzen and Hash 39's brother and the two flee. Knowing this, Gretzen thought she had been deceived and betrayed. In desperation, she went crazy and drowned the newborn baby in the river right after the baby was born. The feudal government arrested and executed Gretzen for murder. After four years of abandoning his lover, Faust returned and tried to save Gretzen from prison, but she thought he had demon blood in him so she refused to escape. Dot. Getchen prayed to God to save him. Demon Mephisto exclaimed, and quat, you have been judged, and quat. From the sky came down, and quat, she has been saved, and quat. Leaving the prison, he sadly lay down to sleep on the grass full of wildflowers. A flock of fairies sang around him and a voice came down from the sky, saying that the girl and number 39's soul would be saved making him forget all the pain. Sad, filled with regret and wanting to work hard again. This is part one of Faust, which can be seen as a complete work. Part two is a completely different work, focusing on political and social issues. The story is not complicated, but the meaning is no less multi-layered and endlessly suggestive, like Russian dolls. If part one is the main interaction within the human heart, between surrender and goodness, then part two emphasizes the inevitable bond between the noble aspirations of the individual and the indifferent imposition of the government, between knowledge. Looking forward to the future and power just requires the present. In part two, he and the devil went to the capital. At this time, the emperor had difficulty with money. He helped the king create paper money to replace metal money to cover all debt expenses. Due to the Enquat. Save the Lord Enquat. Faust met Helen, a peerless beauty of ancient Rome. Living with goddess Helen. The two gave birth to a son, but because he was too naughty, he fell to death. His wife Helen also left and disappeared into nothingness. Faust is extremely miserable. At that time, feudal forces colluded against the king. Faust returned to the north to help the king crush the foreign invaders, keep the land peaceful, and was rewarded by the king with a deserted land by the sea. He applied advanced capitalist scientific advances to production resulting in bountiful harvests. At this time, Faust was a hundred years old. The devil feared that Faust would win and blinded him, but Faust still tried to recruit people to explore and improve nature. Never before had he enjoyed such a holy and boundless joy. Not satisfied with his own happiness, he asked the emperor to let him give back his golden land to the entire people and unquat. Live in a free country among free people and quat. The wish of everyone at that time. With the emperor and number 39's approval, he wanted to give the two old men a bustling farm, replacing the two old men and number 39's miserable hut. The two elders did not agree. Mephisto and number 39's disciples burned down the tent and the two old men burned to death. 
Faust was sentenced to death. But her lover Gretchen was determined to win him back from the demon Mephisto, not only for her but for everyone. Before he died, Faust foresaw that and quot. A free humanity will live in the land of freedom and quot. That they had discovered. However, the ending of the story is very unclear. There are some versions, Faust is saved by God, his soul goes to heaven. There are also places where it is said that Faust must comply with the agreement and go to hell to serve Mephistopheles. Based on the folk tale of a person selling his soul to the devil to satisfy his desire for knowledge and dreams, Goethe introduced in Faust there is profound philosophical content aimed at opposing religious dogmas. Man is not a cruel creature. Humans have a humanitarian nature and always strive to continuously strive to conquer nature, conquer all dark forces in society, and control their destiny to bring a better life. Dot. The work promotes people, with their labor, as a driving force for survival and development. With a compassionate look, Goethe shows tolerance and faith in every human action even though they may inevitably make mistakes in their activities, but in the end they still find the right path to reach their goals. Go up. In addition to the philosophical content, the play also demonstrates the author and number 39, as enormous knowledge of all aspects of politics, science, ethics, philosophy, religion and society, worthy of being a great work. That Goethe pursued throughout his life, giving readers of all generations profound insights into a period in human history. The period of transition between the feudal and bourgeois classes. The play is a voice that strongly denounces feudal society, a society with barbaric laws and its degenerate people who are always trying to pull back the wheel of history. The author also more or less reflects in Faust the appearance of a rising and still progressive bourgeois society, with humane values and the desire to fight for human liberation, but with obvious shortcomings. With the influence of money and the process of primitive capital accumulation. From a character whose actions express an individual and number 39's desire for independence, Faust truly reflects the history of all humanity on its journey. Find the truth and make efforts to change the world towards a complete life, revealing a human history with struggles between good and evil, progress and inhibition. With profound meaning in a poetic lyrical content, the play Faust is truly a dramatic work that brought the great poet Goethe and number 39 talent to its peak, and at the same time the work also deserves to be considered a masterpiece of the greatest plays of all time. Faust has been adapted into many films, first the 1926 version was very successful, the most recent Russian version in 2010, won the Golden Lion Award at the Venice Film Festival in 2010. 2011 Germany also plans to make a new film version based on Faust Wikipedia. Thank you for joining us for today's fairy tale. We hope these stories bring joy and meaning to your day. If you love our channel, please hit the subscribe button so you won't miss any exciting tales. Wishing you a good night and sweet dreams. See you in the next story.